Well, I guess we could expend a bunch of ammo and get some XP. Oh, shit. I hit the wrong button. Wrecked, save me. Save me, Wrecked. Wrecked, I need saving. Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die. I'm the Bearded OG, and this is the Insane Nightmare Series. In this episode, we're going to go into the McKean residence. Um, however, I can now make meat stew, and um, so we need more potatoes to do that. Um, I did, earlier, I spit all but one potato on, you know, making steak and potatoes. And so what we're going to do is we're going to make some more crop plots. I already have a few potatoes growing there. Uh, but we're going to make more crop plots to grow more potatoes. And eventually, you know, uh, we'll have to start growing some corn too after I, you know, make that first batch. Because it takes two corn and two potatoes per stew. So we can make, we'll be able to make a total of seven with the corn that we currently have. All right. So to make a farm plot, let's track that. And we need... Nitrate, clay, wood, and rotting flesh. Um, okay, we got some nitrate there. We got rotting flesh there. Uh, oh, I don't have any clay. Um, I'm going to just put that there. Okay, I guess we're going to have to go dig up some clay. Got a bunch more gunpowder being made in here. I went mining last night, mostly going after nitrate, coal, and some lead. And, oh, shit. All right, well, they screamed, but that doesn't surprise me. I mean, <laughs> I've heated this place up massively. So actually what we're going to do is we're going to vomit And I need, I need to go dig up some clay anyway. So we'll go, just go find a spot out in the woods here and, and do that. And then um, once I have enough clay to make a few farm plots, looks like we're going to need 70 per plot. Uh, we'll come back, set those down, get some potatoes going, and then we'll go on our quest. Uh, I did get one point from mining, and I, I put that into strength, and then I have another point um, on its way. Uh, very close. I guess those guys didn't follow us. The zombies are very persistent, it seems, these days. At least the ones that spawn in from cop cars. <laughs> so, yeah, I think those ones have probably buggered off. So let's just dig into this hill here to get some clay. All right, looks like the Zombadoodles despawned. Uh, by the way, if you guys didn't know, the Screamer hordes happen, or, well, yeah, Screamer waves, appearances, attractions, I don't know, <laughs> happen in 15-minute increments now instead of five, so that way you have a little more of a grace period. All right, so for the farm plot blocks, we can make a total of five. That's good enough for now. And um, I should probably hang on to this extra clay just so we have it for other things. We'll put all that stuff in there. And the nitrate can go in there too. Let's see, we got five water there and four more tea. Oh, I guess I have four tea in there too. That's good. Okay. I'm going to make some more coffee because now that we read the book for... 10% more ore from co being buzzed on coffee. Uh, we definitely want to keep a good supply of that going, too. 
All right, so we'll put those crop plots down. Uh, these are ready to harvest. And we got two more seeds out of that. Do I have any more seeds in here? Yes, look at that. Um, that's almost the perfect amount. We're just shy of one. Uh, so why don't we go ahead and put, actually put a corn in that one? Because I love me some meat stew. It used to be one of the best foods in this game. Um, not anymore, but it's still very good. Okay, so we want that. We want fat. I need to probably start hitting some more corpses and stuff for more fat, even though it's as gross as that sounds. <laughs> Jesus. And we need to do some more hunting, too. But let's see. Uh, we're going to need water, right? Yeah, okay. So we'll grab those, too. And let's make ourselves six meat stews. That's going to take 22 and a half minutes. That'll do. And then after that's done, yeah, this is just going to be a perpetually heated up place. And a few more pieces of wood for the coffee. And we're good to go. Um, let's put... Let's put you down there, you down there, you up here. Okay, I think we're ready to take off. So, I'm topped off on food and water. Maybe we'll take one more bacon and eggs and one more red tea for the road that we can consume while we're out and about. And let's see, we got almost a full stack of 762s. We got a full stack of nines and a full stack of shoddy shells yeah i think we're good all right let's do this a key in residence is right outside or uh, right across the street from the order house that we just did i've already hit that mailbox just looking to see if there's anything that we can quickly double loot doesn't look like it without going in the backyard so let's just do this all right, this is a supply retrieval. There we go, another armor magazine. That's always good. The door is unlocked. Are the weapons loaded? And the helmet light is on. All right, let's do this. Got a hole in the floor. They want us to go down into the basement. All righty. Tell you what we're going to do then in that case. We'll go down into your basement. We're, we're going to do it on our terms. Which means... Let's see. Let's go ahead and... Put some ladders here. I'm not sure if that's, whoops, uh, two up or not. So it isn't, we'll fix it. All right, let's temporary, temporarily block that off so we can just get down here and get rid of this shut, shit, shut, stuff. Shut is a combination of shit and stuff, in case you guys didn't know that. All right, yeah, so we need to pick that one back up. Let's upgrade these so I don't accidentally pick them up in an emergency situation. Look at that. Okay. Uh, I, th I think we'll need those to make an auger in the future. There's a satchel right there. In fact, that is our satchel. Look at all the wood down here. That's nice. All right. Let's once again give ourselves, buy ourselves a second or two. Let's get all this wood. All right. We're done with the quest. <laughs> Let's 
799 pieces of wood. That's wonderful. All right. I think there's zombs through here. Oh, I guess that's not a, an immediately breakable thingy. Jiggly. Pretty sure there's going to be something behind there, too. Because this is a fetch and not a clear, we don't have red dots. Red dots are kind of cheesy, anyways. That's cheaty, man. Unless we had a legitimate, you know, like a thermal heat detector mod or something. Then I'd be more okay with it, but there isn't really a good rational reason to for us to just happen to know where they are, you know. All right. It takes care of another one. Just waiting for him to hold still. <laughs> okay, is that all of them? We're down here? Where'd that go? I don't know. All right, we'll take all of that. What does this give us? Sand and paper. Okay, I'll take it for the paper, more for the sand. Let's see if there's something behind here. Look at that. Um, I'll take those things. This just gives us wood. And this will give us forged iron and scrap iron and mechanical parts and springs. Good stuff. Okay, let's go on upstairs. We'll repair this door in case we need to retreat behind it. All right. Why don't we open this so we have a quick getaway? And there's also couple things out here we can loot. Actually, no, we'll keep that because I used a bunch of it to the, make the seed. Okay, good. More potato seed. Put these all in there. the trash All right. clear in here corn seed did this reset with the house it did all right awesome These give us pipe. I don't think we can wrench these, can we? No. All right, that was a decent amount of pipe. All right, what's over here? Oh, a pig. Piggly Wiggly. Everybody loaded.
Another one of those dog pigs. All right, I think that's good enough for the backyard. Let's drop a few things off before we proceed. Okay. Let's temporarily block that off. Shit. We're good. Let's loot a Zikishon. I'm gonna start hanging on to bones now too because I've had to use them to make glue. Guess that's it for the kitchen, eh? A ladder there. That's the front room. Those shoes are not lootable. We are putting this point right on into strength. That gets us to milk drinker. So now we can do boomstick, skull crusher, 69er in load. Next, and heavy armor. I probably won't do master chef, but we'll see. It is useful, but I don't, whoops, I don't know if it's a priority. You, 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 and you. Rinse the bed. Okay, I think we're ready to go up here. Let's reinforce this door. Forge ahead. Okay, we need six more of those to get to the cement mixer. Armor parts, nice. Get this shit out of the way. Okay, we got a Ronnie McDonnie. Can't really get a headshot though, so he gets a ball shot. Is it just him? I think so. Another door. Looks like we have an Edgar and a janitor. Okay. 
Ooh, that's a feral Edgar. Soften him up a bit. There we go. And I believe we are finished. Get the fat loots. Run speed, 2% athletic shoes. Okay, we'll hang on. Oh, our first armor pocket mod. Very nice. And this is learn how to harvest brass from doors. Nice. That's all good stuff. Take the 7.62s. Always happy to have sewing kits. And more sewing kits. And also steroids, because I actually had run out of those. Here we go. All right, five more to go. I'm really hoping to uh, get... We can stone sledge five, yeah. I'm really hoping to get... Um, can't get through. Oh, fuck it. Let's just go this way. That. Is there anything behind here? Uh, that cement mixer before Horde Night. Uh, we have a pretty good chance, I think, of accomplishing that. We, we just got to go someplace that is going to be more likely to have uh, Forge Ahead books. So, where I'm not exactly even sure where that would be. Well, let's go do the turn in and then we'll see what Rekt has next. Okay, a couple things we want to do before we go see Rekt is... Um, this is, we have a, a spot on here. I think I'd prefer movement over stealth, so we'll put that on there. Oh, you know what, though? Actually, no, I prefer another inventory slot, so let's put this on here. And then all the rest of them have mods, and they only have one mod slot, unfortunately. So, we're going to sell this extra biker helmet, because we already have one. I'm going to have to make another storage chest here pretty soon, because this one's getting... Pretty filled up. I suppose what it could do is maybe take the concrete and cobble and put that, just store that in there with our resources. And I could also melt down. Actually, you know, instead of melting down, let's sell. Let's just sell these. I know we need them for crafting something. What is it? It's like the gas filter or something. Yeah, the supercharger, but. We can get radiator, radiators easy enough, so let's get some coin from what we currently have and also free up some space in the process. Re reload those. And I think I'm going to actually get some 7.62s going here. Where if we... Oh, I can make armor piercing. That just takes... More gunpowder and more bullet tips. Or high power. Yeah, nah, I think we'll I think we'll just stick to the normal. I mean eventually when we get like a sniper rifle, I'll have a dedicated stack of armor piercing for sniping. But for now, I think we'll just stick with the normals. So let's um how many can we make in total? Let's make a hundred. I want to save some gunpowder for pipe bombs for Horde Knight, too, so I don't want to go hog wild on that. Look at that meat stew, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that's a beautiful thing. Uh, but we're not actually hungry right now, so let's save it. We do. We could stand to drink something, but we'll do that. And let's go say hi to Rectipoo. Hi, Rectipoo. Oh, let me... Well, look here, boys. We got ourselves a real nice. life hero, and now he I wants think, to be paid. I think having the Shamway secret recipe would be nice in the long run. Uh, we don't need another helmet light, and we're really pretty good on everything else. So yeah, that's what we're gonna take. Okay. You hungry or something? Let's sell you this, this, those, and those. And I actually have my coin in the bike. All that he resets goods, tomorrow. That's all you buy. Okay, we got two fetch and clears in town. What's this Look, one? Blockhead, I'll give you some the work. The current residence. Not disappoint. 
Okay, hold on. You must be half a zombie already. Oh, look who's tired. Red of barn being bed and bath. And finally ready to do some work. I mean, I don't know. Either one of those. I knew you were a coward. If you want a job from me, what either one of those probably. You better not fuck this up. I, I can't tell from looking at those. Throat. Which running horde right by our bike too. Uh, I can't tell from looking at which one of those is more likely to have forge ahead magazines. Oh, does he have any forge ahead magazines? We should probably look, huh? Because I would buy them at this point. I sell you food, but don't expect me to cook it for you. He's got two. That is good. Shit, man, I treat you that good, and you don't even fucking tip me. Okay, so now we just need to find three more. You guys showed up like at the worst place. <laughs> well, I guess we could expend a bunch of ammo and get some XP. Oh shit, I hit the wrong button. Wrecked, save me. Save me, Wrecked. Wrecked, I need saving. Ouch. Ouch. Not good. This is where I wished I would have had beer on my toolbar. Oh shit, this is- No, get on the bike! God damn it! <laughs> that was close. Whew. Okay. We're good. We got this. Oh my god, that was close, you guys. <laughs> that was really close. Oh man. Good thing we didn't get a bleed effect, or we probably would have died, because I wouldn't have had time to stop and take a bandage. Man, oh man. I went to pick the arrows off of um, Bo's head, and I, <laughs> I opened the fucking gate. Oh, jeez. Can't take me anywhere. I mean, not even to Rex. And I forgot my glasses, too. Of course I did. All right. Shit. Well, there you go. Life and life and times of OG. Par for the course. Let's take a honey. And let's take a first aid bandage for the abrasion. And we'll actually top those off. What else do we need? And we have a sprain, which we can't do anything about. I mean, I could take the steroid, but I think we'll just uh, try and get along without it for now. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> um, let's grab the extra 762s. And we're pretty good on the rest of our ammunition. Top off our shoddy shells. Let's also top off our uh, arrows. So let's see, we need 16. Okay, let's go to this next quest and see what happens. See if we can keep from getting the shit kicked out of us. Actually, how are we doing on... F Whoops. How are we doing on food? Yeah, we're good. Okay. I'll bet Gears has a pretty good chance to have some Forge Aheads. Um, it's a Tier 3. All right, let's keep that in mind. This is the current residence. Let's look and see what's in the backyard here. Not really a whole lot. That's probably locked, yeah. Let's check this pickup truck. No, that's not lootable, but this is. This is another one of those wagons with all the... No, this is a different deal. But we'll take the wooden pipes.
All right, let's do this. Do that bird's nest reset? Nope. We'll hit the mailbox first. Come on, forge ahead. Nope, but we'll take that. All right. Don't really see anything around here except for a... Uh, air conditioner. Let's put uh, you in. Yeah. Actually, no, you go in there. This is clear and retrieve. We're still kind of hurt, aren't we? Yeah, we better not chance it. Let's go ahead and take a bandage. Another bandage. Just, it's both of you. Okay. There's our bird's nest. You guys coming down here or what? we got a sprained leg and a sprained arm and we're fatigued Whew. okay i don't feel like i'm on my a game today you guys <laughs> i really don't oh geez that uh, little encounter at, at rex has thrown me off off my game all right we're gonna take this now unfortunately because i don't want to be Hindered by these sprains. All right. Everybody loaded. Proceed. I'm not gonna. I don't want either one of those things actually. I'm not gonna take the time to wrench the bed this time. Beef that up. Beef that up. Temporarily block that so we don't get any surprises from down below. Well, that door's locked. That door's locked. Guess they want us to go down. Okay. Down we shall go then. The Rick. Alright, who are we talking about here? Is that skater punk? We'll give him a shotgun blast as soon as he. Yes, it is. All right. Okay. Well, I guess we'll go in here then. What are these? Uh, scavenger boots. I think I have an orange pair of those, so we'll just end up selling those. Is this just a, a random side room that isn't part of the normal path? I'm saying probably yes, because I don't know, see any other way in here. Does that mean this is too? Hmm, I don't know.
Alright, nothing in there. Oh no, this is where we came in at. Right, okay. That's just the another door to get in there. You know what? Let's take another bandage. For our health HP. Alright, I'm gonna open this so we can have a quick getaway. see two crawlers in the corner. Three crawlers. Okay, let's block that and let's deal with creepy crawlies. He's been dealt with. He's been dealt with. You're going to go up over the top? What are you going to do, man? <laughs> Come around this way. There you go. Give you a little bit of heat. satchel. Good. We need a couple things of fat. Don't want that. Don't want that. How come we're not encumbered? Oh, because of steroids. Duh. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> See, I'm not on my A game to guys t today, you guys. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. <laughs> I'm like going, what the hell, man? Steroids. Hello. That go shit. Okay. Hidden compartment, man. Sneaky, sneaky. Guess that's all we can take. Scrap those, ditch those. Um, right. I'm pretty sure I've been in this place before, but I don't remember exactly what happens down here. Whatever it is, it won't be good. We can we can definitely count on that. Is this there's another even further down basement it looks like or a cellar or something? Nothing there. Game seems to be reasonably generous with mushroom spores. Seem to find a lot of those, and that's a good thing. Let's 
Let's get rid of a couple of things we don't need to be carrying. Yep, it wants us to go down, down into the deep dark. Is there a thing to open this? Oh yeah, right here. Quick escape. All about some quick escape. I haven't had to cut a tree down in a long time. <laughs> we get so much wood from those piles. All right, so can we can we jump out of here and get? Yeah, okay, we're good. We need a quick getaway. What the hell's going on down here? Is that a corpse or a zombo? I think it's a corpse. Tell you what. Since this place seems to like wood spike traps so much, why don't we make a few of these and put them to good use? I used to use spike traps a lot out in the field in, like early alphas, alpha 16, I think it was 17 or 18, where they changed the zombie AI to where they would start to dodge them better. And after that, I kind of stopped using them as a, an emergency thing. But uh, probably should s s use them more than I do. Okay, I see three red dots. Oh, okay. Any chance I can... in here where the pathway is Get some of this other crap out of the way let's make a few more because why the hell not we're going to totally cheese this man Okay, I see, I see Marlene. Okay, let's try that again. Jesus, how many zombos are down here? I think we did a, a good move with the spiky spike traps. Come on, crawler, crawler. Break those spikes for me and kill yourself in the process. Okay. Try to <laughs> I'm trying to get the spike traps and I hit the zombo corpses. Alright. Can we squeeze past here without hurting ourselves? Let's check the fat loots first. What is this? Nomad gloves. Radiated damage. Like, okay, from... Radiated damage? What? Do greenies give us radiated damage now? Deal 25% more damage to blocks, but 25% less... Oh, yeah, I love that, because I don't usually use an axe anyway for uh, as a weapon though it is a good weapon um yeah anyway what i was saying is do we now take radiation damage from greenies because that seems to imply that and if we do i didn't know that all right we, we definitely want to keep that for fish tacos
I don't want to come back down here, man. Uh, we can do away with eight feathers. Easy enough to find. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay. Um, let's get rid of... Eight. No, not paper. Let's get... Eh, shit, I don't want to throw that cloth away. Ah, damn it, Jim. 20 bones. We'll throw, we'll throw away 20 bones. And now we're massively encumbered. But we're also done. Uh, anything... Oh, no, we got to do this one. And now we're going to throw something else away. How about the hop seed? Can I make beer, though? I can, but we need a chem bench, A, and B. I'm not really going to be using beer until we get the book that saves us from the buzz effects. Okay. All right, I'll meet you guys back at Rex. Rectum, what's up, buddy? Okay, fuck. Well, I guess <laughs> I'm going to have to pay you now that you did Um, it. let's see. I think we will take... Um, there's a lot of ammo. I'm actually going to take the nine. No, let's take the 762 ammo. What's it going to be, huh? We'll sell that to him. No refunds. Deal's done. Now, unless you're paying, we already looked you're leaving. to see if he had a cement mixer, right? And he doesn't. Pretty sure that I did, but let's check again. Got a crucible. Nope, he doesn't. Uh, he's got a. Yeah, that's that's probably the one that we sold to him. Oh, some days I don't even know why I open the doors. Listen up, jackass. Okay, we'll do this you red barn bed and bath jackass. later. We'll take the job. The All right, here's the deal, guys. Um, tomorrow, which is day 19. Well, first of all, wrecked. Inventory resets tomorrow, so we'll check that. If we don't get a cement mixer or enough forge ahead magazines, it's not likely he's going to have three. We'll go do gears. Um, and if we don't find forge ahead magazines from enough, you know, to do the cement mixer from doing gears, then we're going to go on a road trip and hit the other traders up. Um... You know, they all reset tomorrow, but I don't think I can make it to... We do have a wrecked here. Right here. Don't know if I can get down there in time, though. That would really be cutting it close, wouldn't it? I'm going to try it. Uh, I have all my coin with me, right? Yeah. And we'll keep those with me too. Uh, here, let's do one more thing before we take off. Uh, I'm just going to grab some more food and drink to top that off. Uh, let's just do. Let's grab two bacon and eggs and two red tea. And we'll save our better food for later. I don't know if I'm going <laughs> to. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this, but we'll try. And if I don't make it, then I'll just salvage on the way, salvage my way home, I guess. Um, yeah, or something like that. See if we can get down there. There's one other thing I should be doing, too. Let's just take this armor off. We'll go naked on that chorale, because that'll help us with stamina. All right, there's no way we're going to make it to him. Um, and actually... He's even further down. I was in the wrong spot. But what I am going to do is I'm going to stay down here. And I'm just going to salvage overnight. And I'll just run away from Zeke's on the bike. Uh, ferals that chase me. And that way we can start the morning off with Trader Jin, who's the furthest south. We'll check her inventory. Then we'll go to Trader Joel. Then we'll go to, to the other Trader Wrecked. And just kind of work our way back. Um, and... We have a pretty high probability of finding three more Forge Ahead magazines by doing that. 
And there's even a possibility I could find, you know, one in a car too, as I salvage overnight. I'll keep the recorder running in case I find something really good in a car or something crazy happens. But otherwise, we're going to wrap up this episode here and I'll see you guys in the next episode. The morning of day 19, where we will hopefully find three more Forge Ahead magazines so we can make the cement mixer in preparation for the next Horde night. Thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video, and we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.